So can you give us your name and your role first, please? Yes, uh, my name is Aaron Toho, and I am the manager of the Randox Food Diagnostics Honey Division. And what products do you provide into the honey market, Aaron? Well, we provide several different uh, products, um, the most notable being uh, antibiotic screening solutions for the honey industry. And what sections of the industry in particular use those types of products? Uh, well, mainly honey exporting companies and government laboratories and also like private research institutes. So have you observed any regulatory changes within the honey industry recently? Well, honey is always deemed to be quite a pure product and because of this here, the testing on honey is quite intense. So basically the testing parameters need to be very, very low for uh, honey and um, because of this here, there's a lot of pressure within the industry in order to meet these here types of demands. Okay. And why has Randox been able to capitalize on that opportunity? Well, we have a series of different uh, unique selling points to our um, evidence investigator, which we're promoting here at this conference. Um, what we offer are simple sample preparation. We also offer multi analyte testing with the different arrays that we provide. And uh, most importantly, we provide very, very low limits of detection. And what are the main products that the industry is screening for? Well, there's an entire uh, plethora of different types of antibiotics, uh, the most notable ones being chloramphenicol, streptomycin, tetracyclines. But more and more, we're seeing new tests, um, or sorry, new different types of analytes being common prominent within the market. Um, probably the most notable would be nitromidazoles at the moment, specifically metronidazole. And what innovations have you brought to your business strategy recently? Well, we've been able to uh, carry out a series of different roadshows uh, within the market uh, when and where requested. Um, so we're always open to doing new roadshows in like high areas of honey production. So what particular markets do Randox Food Diagnostics serve within the honey industry? Well, we are quite prevalent in the majority of continents all around the world, uh, but most notably in, we have placements in the likes of Mexico, Australia and Europe. Uh, specifically uh, within Eastern Europe, we're seeing a, quite a considerable spike in sales at the moment. And obviously this conference is within Eastern European region and Croatia. What are you most looking forward to at the conference? Well, we're looking forward to meeting both uh, new customers and current customers. Um, what we also have is uh, a small poster at the conference and um, we'll be doing a presentation at it in order to showcase the technology. Excellent. Thank you very much. Thank you.